Welcome to the staff data population training. In today's training, we will discuss the data details, field specification, submission requirements, and how to resolve validation errors. This training was specifically created for CalPads data coordinators. Those of you who are new to CalPads will benefit from today's training, but if you are not completed the sequence of prerequisite trainings, some concepts may be lost on you. The staff demographic training is a part of fall two and end of year sequence of training. So let's review the objectives for this training so we know what to focus on. First, let's identify the staff data required to complete the CalPad submission. Next, we want to prepare for the staff data requirements by being aware of changes and their impact. Then we'll perform the population process through online maintenance or batch file upload. And lastly, we'll take a look at the resources, technique, tips for staff demographic error correction process. Here is the agenda for this training. We will discuss the following. An overview for the submission, discuss the details of the business rules and field specifications related to the data population, spend some time on how data should be reported by viewing examples, cover a few common validation errors, and lastly discuss the submission errors before wrapping it up.